There's always something going on at the state parks in Delaware. Even on Halloween, believe it or not, the Delaware Seashore State Park was packed with folks enjoying some great fishing as well as championship barbecue. In the shadow of the Indian River Inlet Bridge, folks were enjoying some beautiful fall weather while trying to entice some tautog out of the rocks. Slow, very slow. I don't think the water temperature's quite right yet. For others, today's fishing is a spectator sport. Well, I moved down here about a year ago, and I have a boat over here in Indian River Marina. But the Delaware fishing is a lot different than North New Jersey fishing, so I'm trying to learn the ins and outs. The beach has become a year-round destination for folks here on Delmarva. It's Halloween, and just 100 yards from the fishing, there's a KCBS barbecue competition in high gear. A little more time. Here you'll find some of the best pitmasters on the East Coast and beyond competing for cash prizes and bragging rights and the first ever boobacue by the sea. We got black lights up underneath the tent over here, a uh, giant spider hanging down. If you look around the park today, I've been scared about 20 times with some of these masks walking around and I don't even know who the people are when they come up to me. So it sort of adds a little different twist to, to barbecue. We have here the third place winner of the Jack Daniels, which was held just last week in Lynchburg, Tennessee. And for those who aren't up to date with the terminology of barbecue, it's like the World Series in barbecue. So we have people from Connecticut, North Carolina, Virginia, of course, 19 Delaware teams that are so tickled that there's a contest in their state. So it, it, just everybody's in a good mood, they're happy, and that's what they're supposed to be. That's a bit off for me being Australian. Halloween doesn't, we don't really have Halloween, but that's a good idea, I think. You don't know, get out and about and find a different way of celebrating it. It's a, it's a, it's a nice good idea, why not? Australians usually scare the crap out of people, you know, on a daily <laughs> basis. Six, so it'll be like a day six, dedicated four, to it. <laughs> this location near the Delaware State Park at the inland is fairly new. It's just been, you know, completed a couple years ago. The barbecuers love it. They absolutely love it. The hookups are right here for them. From a competitor's perspective, this is an ideal venue. I mean, all the services are readily accessible. Everything's a quick hookup. And many events we go to, it's like, you have to prepare for the worst. But so far, top shelf. He's right. In fact, just about a month ago, the Delaware State Park System had the honor of winning the NRPA gold medal for being the top state park system in the nation. From hiking and bike trails through beautiful forests to freshwater ponds and the seashore state parks, we here on Delmarva are very fortunate to have these places right in our own backyard. First one I've ever caught. I've been down here and heard their biting and did some research yesterday and uh, went and got what I needed today and fished for about the last four hours and finally landed a keeper. So make no bones about it. Any time of the year is a great time to visit Delaware's beautiful state parks. It's beautiful. You got barbecue, you've got the ocean, and it's what life is all about. <laughs>